Hi guys. Welcome to Maximum Yarnage. I'm Michelle. Yeah. Listen, so much has happened since the last time that I got on this thing. And I'm a little peeved. My phone broke. And I haven't been able to get it fixed. So, it's a problem. That's going to really put a damp damper on my um, live streaming on the road kind of thing. But it's okay. We'll figure it out. Look what I got. I got a pumpkin. I got a pumpkin. So pretty. Well, yeah, I thought I could like do something and like decorate it or something. But I don't think I'm going to stick like knitting needles in it. That would be weird. So I might wrap it up in a little bit of yarn. I don't know what kind of yarn yet. I'll figure it out. Um, I'm a little like pooped. I was, I went out today to uh, try and figure out this issue with the phone. And I haven't been able to because Samsung doesn't have the parts. I was getting the runaround the other day from Sprint and they sent me to another store. That store couldn't help me. They told me to go to Samsung. Now Samsung can't help me. And I was stuck in Los Angeles in downtown trying to get this done for I don't know how long. And I'm really, really tired. So we went out to dinner afterwards to this like Korean barbecue place that was like not too far from the area. And it was really nice. Uh, we haven't been there for a while, but it was nice. And I was going to do a live broadcast from the Korean barbecue place. But it, it was so loud. The music was like unreal kind of loud. And I probably could have done video and then come back here and splice it. But really, I'm not going to do that right now. I'm not ready for that yet. Let's take it baby steps. Okay? I only just started. Kind of, sort of. That was a little bit of a fib. But it's alright. Hey! I got some new makeup. And I just wanted to show it to you guys because I thought it was kind of... Like, I thought it was kind of cool. It's already dingy. But I went into the CVS and I found this called Feline and this. And I'm already in love with this. And look at the point on that. It just doesn't want to focus right now and I don't care to make it focus. Yeah. Look. Woo! So cool. I love it. And I also got this, but I think I am allergic. And I don't like it. Like, I like this one. This is mine and I ran out. Yeah, that's mine and I ran out. So now I'm like looking for a replacement and I can't find it. I don't know why I did that. Okay, so what I wanted to tell you guys right now was a quick update. I know I'm supposed to be doing a better job than this, but I'm in a hurry. It's like 9.42. I'm exhausted. I have to actually get ready for bed um, to get up to go to work tomorrow. But look at how much progress I've made uh, with my sockies. My sockies. These are my husband's socks. He has pretty big feet. I'm hoping that I didn't like mess the whole thing up. Here's my problem. I have no issue getting started with the toe and doing the body. But I have yet, well, I have never done a gusset until now. And I started the gusset. And I actually, I think I'm doing an okay job. And I think I'm understanding sock construction a heck of a lot better than I did before 
down to where I even got a bit of the math going on. See, I, I've done everything. I've downloaded the fish kips, fish lips kiss heel. I've downloaded the sock meticians, you know, very lengthy thing, um, very intelligently written pattern recipe. It's amazing. And I can't, I'm like, my eyes just go boop. Same thing with the fish ki kiss lips thing. It's such a great amount of information. Just looks like a wealth of stuff. But my brain just goes bloop. And I just can't, like, I'm like, somebody just give it to me really quick and dirty. Simple. And I already have the heel turn down pat. I just, you know, the gusset plus heel turn just wasn't it wasn't clicking and also my wrap turns like on the I like to do the German short row heel um and so my wrap and turns the stitches in the middle of that heel they're just not matching up properly so I got it down and um and I I did it with this girl April Kilch's help I did I haven't really looked at this pattern um, except to verify something. I printed out several of her patterns to verify something because on her website, they're free. Um, and it was extremely helpful. What was helpful was her, um, what do you call it? Her explanation of the math that's involved to do the gusset. And that was, I, I don't want to like, you know, you have to go to her website but I did print some of this stuff out for myself. Um, and I also, because of it, did my own calculator. So all I have to do is enter my stitches here. And then everything gets loaded up there. And it makes it a lot easier for it to click in my brain. I need something more clear and concise and less cluttered uh, in order for it to make sense in my brain. So I, I have that down. Maybe one of these days I'll sit down and I'll go over what I, I learned and how I do this. I basically cast on my toe on one set of needles all the way up and work it all the way up and only work the back rows. I never remove anything from the needles. I never rearrange anything on the needles. I never do any of that stuff um, that I've heard and seen other people do. Uh, I don't turn things around. I don't take anything off. I just work the back rows when it's time to work the back rows. All right here. And I don't get confused or lost or anything. But it's a process. It's a process. And I think I might have some fun explaining it to you guys at a later date. I'll probably start off small. Like maybe doing it on Periscope. I think that will be much, um, much easier. I'll, I'll show you really quick something else that I did last night. And they're really goofy and really simple. I'm not good at, at doing this sort of thing. But I really like the way I put them on this little thing. Like, I made this, you guys. I'm apparently a little crafty. I, I actually am more in love with that little thing than I am with these. <laughs> these are very cool too though. Um, They're just little Michael skulls. Super cute. Yeah. So that's me being all makery for Halloween. What else was I going to do? I don't think I was going to do anything else, you guys. Uh, I think I'm just... I'm going to call it a day I'm exhausted where's the noise yeah I'm tired so tired and I have to go to bed I don't know what music that is huh yeah people play it anyway oh wow look at the time fly and I just did nothing but babble I'll get better Probably not. It's like a good 
any better than this, you guys. It's not. This is terrible. Oh, well. Hey, did I ever show you my makeup bag? <laughs> what is that? God. <laughs> ah! Yeah. <laughs> what else? I have nothing else. I'm going to go now. Okay. That was a great, fabulous episode. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Or not. Probably not. Because stuff. Oh. Um, did you know I was pretty much maximum yarnage everywhere? Like Twitter and Twitter and Twitter. <laughs> I kind of use Instagram. You gotta look me up. Or just go to my about page. Oh god, I'm just the worst. I'm gonna go now. I'll see you guys later. Bye!